What up, what up, what up? It's your boy B Green, and this is episode 19 of Five Minutes with an Indie. Arigato gozaimasu. Thank you for coming in and kicking it. For all those peeping this on YouTube, shout out to y'all. For all those peeping this on Twitch later, shout out to y'all. Y'all know what it is. Big ups to everyone out there. Hopefully, everyone's being safe. Hopefully, everyone's maintaining during this tumultuous time that we're living in. <sighs> Shit's nuts out there, guys. Shit is nuts out there, guys. And that is not a gender-specific term for me. Guys means everyone that's a friend. So, shout out to y'all. Y'all know what it is. Bang. All right. Ten games from itch.io's bundle for racial justice and equality. If you don't know what it is, I'm putting it in the chat. And yeah, that's where we at. Shout out to last week. Last week was good. Episode 18. Once again, Cater, um, Caterpocalypse. I forgot what that game was called. But the cat game. Ooh, sorry. Joker hit me up. No, nah. let me mute that real quick. But yeah, uh, what was I doing? Oh, damn, damn, just that little thing just throws me off like that, huh? It's gross. I, sh- I shouldn't be that distracted. But you know, what was it called? Cat, cat lateral damage. That was it. Shout out to them. The developer was Manicoware. Shout out to them. You know, yeah. All right, let's get into it. Bang. So I already pre-downloaded everything. We're going to start today off with Backfire. The description for this one, oddly enough, was in Spanish. It said, Sin municiones, pero no sin opciones quemo a tu adversario usando el profesor de tu nave by Nebula Projects. Yeah, so I don't know what any of that Oh, we got Google Translate, right? I can just do that. What am I acting like I'm not techno- technologically gifted? Google Translate. What y'all telling me? Bang. Without ammunition, but not without options, burn your adversary using your ship's thruster. Ooh. Oh. Backfire. Makes sense. Shout out to them. Let's get it in. See, I downloaded everything, but... I didn't install everything. (sighs) All right. Let's set that timer. What? Uh. (sighs) Okay. All right. I just hate when games make you or request access to network permissions and it's not a network permitted game. Like, what are we doing here? I guess it's not working, guys. I guess it's not working. This is gross. Give these give these apps a platform, and they sit here and they do it. They do this to me. They do this to me. Is open in a game maker studio game. What does that mean? All right, so I got a task manager. This shit the hell out. See, that's what I'm talking about. I be trying to, I be trying to, now I feel like I'm wasting mad time trying to figure this out when I could be playing with y'all, like, end task, end task, end task, delete forever, like, come on guys, get it together, alright, so we're going to skip that one. I mean, I should have known something was up when I and shit was in Spanish. Like, 
That's the first time I even experienced that in this. All right, Cardinal Chains, an original puzzle game about non-decreasing sequences by Daniel Nora. Okay. All right. Let's set that timer. I'm going back to the phone timer. Set timer for five minutes. And here we go. Ooh, that was satisfying. Ooh, that's super satisfying. Ooh, that's triple satisfying. So I'm assuming the point is you can't double up over yourself. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Oh, so what? Hmm, I wonder how that's going to go. Ooh, okay. I'm just really good at this. Developers are going to be like, yo, did we make this game too easy? Because this man be green, bro. Ah, shit. Psych? Like, come on, you know me. I'm just playing with y'all, player. I'm on fire. Different. Different. I'm a different type of fellow. Othello. Hello, motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. What's up? Generic. Shout out to you. Hopefully work's going swell for you, player. I know you uh out there getting that money. Doing what you got to do to take care of your loved ones. Appreciate you. Appreciate you for showing love like you always do. Listen, I had a hell of a time playing Ghost of Tsushima this weekend. I got right back into it. it took me a little bit. It took me like a good like 20 minutes. And I'm telling you, when that multiplayer come out, it's going to be a problem. And when I beat Ghost of Tsushima, which I don't know when that will be because it's one of those games where it's one of those games where you feel encouraged to do all of the little side shit. So I don't know when that will be, but when I uh when I uh when I beat Ghost of Tsushima, I will definitely be reinstalling I already got it installed I will be booting up Destiny I'm back I think Destiny is going to take me to the end of the generation oh shit you think I'm scared look at this come on son who you think I oh oh who you think I am I got this player Let's go, cash money. Yeah. Oh, this is different. Oh, we got two colors now. You see what they try to do to me? I'm over here doing math like. But it's cool. I got this. I'm down for some multiplayer. Oh, come on, baby. You know, we got a squad. We got a squad. You know, I just got my boy, Kevin. Shout out to Kevin. He uh, finally made the jump. He finally made the jump. He finally made the damn transition. He got rid of his Xbox. He didn't get rid of it, but he is no longer Mr. Xbox. Ooh. If I put that one there, so 
thought you had me. You ain't have me. You barely had yourself. Surprised that 50 shot of Nas didn't blow off the manifold intake. The gas. The man, granny shifting, not double clutch. Barely had me. You barely had your car. Oh, timer. So. See what you want to do here. Oh, no. Watch this. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. 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 If I bring this over. Mm, got it. Right? Didn't. I'm a genius! A genius! You know what it is. Get to it. Get to it. Alright. So that was... Uh, level 27 in 5 minutes. That gotta be like a record, kinda. Like, for not having any sort of semblance of what was going on before I went into that game. That was Cardinal Chains by Daniel Nora. Is it worth the 5 minutes? Da -da -da. Absolutely. Any game. Should I change the 5 minute sounds to this? Yes. And then when it's not worth 5 minutes, I do this. But I kinda like... Nah, we'll see. Um, but yeah, no, uh, definitely worth the five minutes. Super clean UI. You know how I am. I am a sucker for a game, especially a puzzle game, a game where you see a lot of the UI because you're usually in and out of it, dropping a couple minutes here and there. But uh, you spend more time in the menus, whether it's restarting, resetting. So when you can give me minimal, clean, where's my number? Oh, minimal, clean. Minimal, clean, and straightforward. I don't want it, that to sound like minimal, too, but it's not. Like, when the gameplay is straightforward, then you checked off all the boxes for me. Definitely worth five minutes. Go get that shit a play. That shit was awesome. Awesome. All right, next we have Penance. Destroy Sin Earn your peace, old school FPS with procedural levels and a campaign mode by Akels Axelmo and Skull Games. Ooh. Ooh. That shit sounds a little. <laughs> All right. Sorry. My bad. I apologize. I want that to happen again. Let's set that timer. Set timer five minutes. All right, let's go. Let's do shoot you start. Uh, let's just do start game. Start from the beginning. What you did, it was wrong. It was wise to ask us for penance, and that we shall grant to you. Your name has been stripped from you to yourself and the halls of history rendered from now as the damned one. Damn, that you sucks. to be cast forth unto the forbidden church, that which we abandoned during the first years of our war on sin itself. The doors we shut behind you, signaling to all your journey. Take up your sword and your pistol. Today and until the end of time, you shall fulfill your penance. Walk through the portal, show them our Lord's will, and all your past wrongdoings shall be forgiven forevermore. Oh shit, this shit look just like Hexen. Wait, what? just happened I, what just oh that was another timer sorry hey I got a pill I got a pistol and a gun oh shit oh ah! 
Oh, okay. I'm, I'm about to shoot these little demon motherfuckers. Ah. Uh. Damn, son. They came at me crazy. Two. Hold on. Let me, let me turn this down a little bit. All right. I don't know what that says. Oh, oh, there's another one. Got an ADS button. Okay. Ooh, got the shotgun, baby. Nice. Okay. Quick switch. Let's go. Who want what? No headshot, no hitboxes on the headshots. You remember Hexen, bro? Hexen was crazy. Oh shit. I miss the days where um, FPSs just felt like heretic. That was the other uh, her her heretic, heretic. What was it called? Heretic, heretic, heretic. Her however you say that, heretic, right? I just miss the days where like. It just felt as... Oh, yeah, I'm about to do this then. It just felt as if... FPSs... Weren't limited by the game... Oh, snap, I almost died. It just felt like they weren't limited by the game type to be creative. Like, the fact that it games were just first person... Were just the method in which it delivered the story, not the type of gameplay it needed to be. You remember uh, System Shock? <sighs> oh. Oh, you still hit me? Oh. What the hell? Oh. Oh, that's a lot of motherfuckers. Light work. Oh, that's painful. The hell? I gotta kill them all. Nobody's making it out. <clears throat> oh, I got the shoddy. You know what they say. I don't know what they say, actually. But... Oh, he gonna follow me? Oh, they did follow me. Okay, nice bullet spread there. I like how the, the different guns actually feel like different guns. Well, timer went off. But before we do that, we gotta go back to that portal. We gotta see what that portal does. Oh, shit. Back up. Back up. What was that little motherfucker right there? What is that? That thing is terrifying. Stop it. Stop. I just... Is there a... Oh, those are dogs! Oh, no! You motherfuckers came fast! I know it's been five minutes, but I feel like I'm on a roll right now. Alright. 
Let's finish it. Sword only. I'm about to give him my Excalibur. Die, you filthy mutts! You varmin! Ha! Ha! Dun 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 Come here. Oh shit, they got guns? Requiascat in passe. Rest in peace, baby. Okay. Alright, so that was Penance by Axelmo Scale Games. Yeah, definitely worth the five minutes. Or should I say? Um Yeah, so out the gate. The and I mean I guess anytime you have demonic vibes interlaced with the FPS, you're just going to naturally get the heretic and hexen type comparisons. But I think those are fair comparisons. I think there's something to say about an FPS that focuses on the angle of overall evil, right? Uh, plays fast a la doom uh the enemies are fast they interesting style and uh yeah huh dope all right ring ring you found a strange phone on the beach who will you call by Hiloko. Hiloko? Hiloko. 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 all right let's give this a go Set timer, five minutes. English, baby. Let's play it in English. Because I can't understand Francois. Or French. Ring, ring. Please don't be scary. Okay. Eight. Zero. Zero. Okay, well, nine, one, one. Oh, okay. Let's see what's under the phone. I don't have enough mouth space. I need more DPI. What's that? Looks like a, a little... Come on, stop it. Okay, maybe I'm not supposed to... Operator, maybe? Um, eight, six, seven, five, eight, six, seven, five, three, oh, nine. Okay, let's try that. Eight, six, seven, five. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Eight, six, seven, five. Hello? Eight, six, seven, five. Alright, they clearly don't want me to 
Should I call it 911? Hey, Shawnee got me moving on the dance floor. Ooh, whoa. Hi, it's Kate from your favorite dating service. We have set up a date for you this evening. She'll be waiting for you at Southwest 53rd Place. Nice. As usual, make sure you wear something fancy. Okay. Got a date tonight. Y'all know what that means. <laughs> All right. Um. Uh. What's up? What's up, George? I don't trust George. The fair breeze blew. The white foam flew. Sounds like a sex poem. The furrow followed free. And he hung up on me. Um. Five. 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 Oh, a newcomer. Hello there. I wouldn't answer any phone calls recklessly if I were you. Or you will end up stuck here like me. Nah, son. S oh, that's because I'm not calling the right number. 69. 69. Is someone out there? Can you hear me? Help. I'm trapped. Um. What do we do? Do we pick it up? Do we pick it up? <sighs> Hi, it's George. Remember me? Listen closely. I don't have much time. I'm trapped in this phone. Like everyone you've been talking to, they all found this phone and encountered the evil spirit that lives in it. You will need to. What was that? Oh no. The spirit has noticed our call. It's trying to trap you too. Hang up the phone. Dungeons and Lesbians, mildly dating your BFFs in the midst of a game of D&D by nobodies. Okay. Nah, son. Nope. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Not I. Not Bry. Shit. Y'all wildin'. Hey. Hey. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. Listen. These are the dungeons and lesbians. 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 Now let's begin. So we chillin' Saturday night. Me and all my girls, we ain't having no fight. Double up. Mm. Oh, the beat switch. I wasn't ready for the beat switch. I was not ready. I was not ready. All right, let's get into it. Set timer for five minutes. Frankel Winkle. Hello, hero. It's good to see you. You will enter a world of swords and sorcery where giant lizards thinks things. 
You will enter a world of swords and sorcery where giant lizard things think thievery and regicide is a good idea. Let me show you what you look like. Don't question why you look like that. It's time to name yourself. What's your name? MC... Uh, what's your name? Brianna. I am a she, her. Welcome, Brianna. The thing is, the world has always been one that longs for a hero. What's a hero? Someone who fills the world with change and splendor, with courage and love in their hearts. Appreciate you, generic. You're awesome. You're a hero. But remember, a hero isn't one person. No man is an island, or so they say. I might recommend for you to build up your relationships. Be in touch with your heart so you can touch others. In other words, be as gay as your heart desires, you funky little lesbian. You're getting what you paid for. Venture thus unto the world and let your heroic tales unfold. Up. Level, you've arrived. Heck yeah, final boss. Heck yeah. Don't copy me, you nerd. All right, all right. Shut it, it's my turn. I mean, Lena's going to continue. Thanks, Raffi. <clears throat> So you've all come to the end of your journey. Flames roar all about you, trapped in a cage of heat and noise. Unnaturally high for your run-of-the-mill forest fires. Those ain't no ordinary flames. They're magic ones, cast by the very evil sorcerer. Yes, the one in front of you right now. Some old dude, you mere fools, you are foolish fools to think that you could fool around with me, you fools. Ever defeat I, Prozac the Powerful. Full. The very evil sorcerer cackles, <laughs> raising his staff high right into the sky at your obvious defeat, so it seems. Hold it, fiend. <laughs> A literal knight in shining armor. The tank of your party rises, basically blinding you in her glory. And this is just the beginning of the story. For eons, you've reigned. Eons of terror. You pushed the innocence of this land into a um, reign of terror. Well, no more. My trusty fellow allies are trust shall vanquish thee her heart ending spoops heart rending speech strikes a chord in all of your hearts you a trusty ally of trust cannot simply stand mutely mute oh, shit all right crew foal for too long have god's mercy kept thee on oh do you have a donkey because we're here to kick your ass a a a a a a a uh huh uh huh you okay yo what's, what's in your mouth oh yo what eloquent words as expected of a bard inspired by your poetry the remaining member of your party too scrambles to a stand with newfound unfamiliar valiantness she points an accusing finger at the very evil sorcerer determination burning in her eyes she opens her mouth capturing the full attention of the enemy i have no part in this i'm actually just in it for the money in fact, she offers 10 gold to attack your party instead. Silence reigns across the dungeon. The sorcerer ponders the business offer. This is your chance. You throw your dank guitar at the sorcerer while he's distracted. You, a brilliant strategist, devise perfect plans. You execute immediately. Dank guitar smashes into smithereens. You gain 10 plus punk. You also shed a single tear. Rest in peace, guitar.
Okay. All right. That was an adventure. Damn. All right. That was uh, Dungeons and Lesbians. I have never played a Dungeons and Dragons adventure, a game, uh, just Dungeon. I've never played Dungeons and Dragons, a LARP, any of that. So anytime I'm able to kind of get a glimpse into the world of Dungeons and Dragons, especially without having to actually do the work of playing Dungeons and Dragons, I'm always taking it back. It's kind, it's kind of, it's kind of cool, especially if you got dope music by that, like. I kind of, I kind of, I kind of killed that one. Is it worth the five minutes? Da, da, da. Absolutely. All right. So we got the old man plus extra chapter. I'm assuming extra chapter is maybe they added something in the main game was the old man. But um, this game's description follow. Let's see. Follow the adventure of various characters trying to make it out alive by Okamist Studio. Nice. All right. Let's fucking do this shit, bro. Let's go. And yeah, thanks. Thanks, uh, Brian. I'm feeling way better, bro. I don't know what the fuck it was last week. It took me like two days to kind of get my shit back. But I'm, I'm, I'm all, I'm all better, man. Appreciate you, bro. Set timer for five minutes. Oh, what's this? Is that the sky that I look at with my eyes? As the rain falls and the storm calls. A rainy day just like any other. A homeless man, an old man, or old regular brother walks alone in the dark street on the border of the city. Hear his heartbeat. Uh, uh, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. The last few buildings stare at him from above like casting a judge. Oops, fucked it up. Like casting a judging stare on his poor soul, wondering about his life choices, the old man focuses his eyes on the last street, searching for a place to hide. Now I'm wondering why, as the rain falls cold wet from the sky, in front of the old man lies the last bastion of hope. I ain't talking about dope. A few buildings on the edge of the city. Hopefully he can find a straighter that'll give him some pity. Well, this is the last street. If I can't find shelter, then my heart will beat. I said beat already. I can't keep rhyming with beat. There's a steel pipe here. What's, what do I do with that? I think that's a metal bar. Hard to see with this rain. Can I pick it up? Take that shit, son. Yeah, it's a metal pipe. Okay. Oh, I walked over there. Pick that shit up. This is badly damaged. You got steel pipe. Nice. Should I go in? I mean, it's red. Nah. Let me go in here. Beer door. Alright, let's go in this door. Fuck it. The old man enters the building and closes the door behind him. Beep. Oh shit, I'm in an office. That was the electronic lock. I'm stuck here now. Current objective, explore the office. Oh. A printer with a fax combo, but not a scanner. This is really old. Let's grab some coffee, bro. Man, this guy is not even clean the jar before leaving. Office memo. Please use as much paper as you want. This bio-friendly paper saves a lot of money for the company. Clean your asses with it if you want. Paul. Thanks, Paul. Appreciate you. Yeah. What the hell does that mean? Let's see. What the hell is that? Poem. No luck. 
snack notice. Since you guys only buy the best snacks from this machine, we modify a few ways to ensure maximum consumption. You can no longer take back any spare change or refund once the money goes in and never comes out. Snacks will cost 75 cents each, but you can no longer choose what will drop. That's fucked up. What's happening here? The sign says no. Yeah, it is weird, right? How do I go back, though? Why do I feel like the screen cut off? I guess I'm going this way. Secure Tech 3000. I used to work at the company that makes these things. For security reasons, the same team can't work in the next version still, I can identify. Well, I'm about to press these shits because I don't want the shit to get locked in. I get in trouble. Uh. Alright, I gotta pause this because I need to go. piece of paper in my pocket what did I say something is written on it right click an item and see the description click and to select an item click an item and close the menu to use the item oh ah, fuck see that's some shit hold on hold on hold on hold on I still got like a minute left with that game I just I wanted to see if there was a way to get it in full screen Yes, there was. See? Aha! Aha! So, developer, make sure that you find some way to fix that so that when it's played in window mode, you can still get access to certain parts. Ah, oh, shit. It started me all over. That's fucked up. Aw. <sighs> I'm not rapping this again, by the way. So, you know, <laughs> it is what it is. Yep. Uh-huh. Old man. Uh-huh. Mm, okay. Yep. 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 Come on. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's go. Let's walk over here. Let me pick that up. Pick that shit up. Yep. 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 You better grab it. Yes. Go in, bro. Ah, see? Now the, cur the thing's up here timer set off. Ooh, sandwich! I didn't see that sandwich before. Nice, I got a Bologna sandwich. My Bologna has a first name. Hey guys, we need to do something about the plant competition. Those guys of side B are kicking our butt and I refuse to lose the coffee table privilege. I was thinking about poisoning their plants or something. Come see me. Oh shit. That's rude. Hmm. Guys, remember to give me the 20 bucks for the new plants. If we keep replacing them with new ones, we gonna win this shit. Aha! Left corridor. Oh, change. Three quarters. We know what that means. That's 50 cent. I'm stupid. That's 75 cent. So what I wanted to do is... Delicious snack once I put... Oh, so hit that and hit that. Here goes nothing. Put money into the machine. Give me a snack. It better be good. Better not get stuck either. Something did fall. What was it? I got something. A Snickers Duo. Hey. Can I take this? Nothing happens. Oh, you're supposed to beat the damn thing, bro. See? That's that shit. Oh, boom. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. 
Okay. Um, that was old man plus extra chapter. Definitely worth the five minutes. I like that. Um, I just uh, I like I I miss like point and click adventure games. Remember those games? Remember Dust? Fucking Dust, man. Fucking Dust. Huh. All right, Catlandia Crisis at Fort Pawprint. Be a cat by Catlandia. They're full on with this cat thing here. Second week in a row playing a cat game. Hmm. I wonder if they're on to something here. Hmm. You like my hair? Uh, see? <sighs> All right. Set timer to five minutes. Starting a new game. Let's go. Crisis set for this is Nugget, the famous cat Mondo. But what does Nugget look like? That's up to you. Tap part of Nug's body to edit it. Oh yes, let's go. Let's make cat a I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. That's his body. Oh, let's do a big chonky cat. Hey. Let's do a big chonky cat, right? But instead, we're going to do this and then make that part white. Yeah. Let's do his legs. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I hope that's the right. I can't see. One, two, three. Let's go back to the white. One, two, three. Okay. And let's get that tail. All right, let's go. I'm a cat. I'm a cat cat. Full throttle. Sausage nugget nugget. Oh, there you are. What's going on, sausage? Oh, why they got berets on? Sergeant Fluffles wants to see both of us right away. I'm so excited. It's been forever since we've been asked to do anything. Suppose it's about time we earned our keep. Yeah, it's been great. What do you think it could be? Could the cat queen be calling us back to the cat kingdom? Life out here at Fort Paul Print is all right. But I could use a night of sleep in my favorite pile of blankets. What do you think, Nug? I don't like that nickname. Nah, he wouldn't lose it a third time, would he? Well, anyway, he should be at his usual spot. Let's go. All set. Oh, uh, so. So open up menus, hold down information. Okay. Press where you want to go and you move forward. Press and hold down on yourself. You open up a bunch of move menus. Find new things to wear to boost stats. Oh, yeah. When you see Fort Parker and Fisher Bandit's top right corner, we're auto-saving. Okay. So, I'm currently just dragging. Were you looking hard? Oh, shit. A bit of a pickle. Misplaces teapot. Oh shit, it's a turn-based battle. Bite, scratch, pounce. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, that's dope. <laughs> Exposed. Huh. Now, okay. Mugic, get it? And slash in. Ooh, ooh. Timer went off. Interesting. Okay. I guess those are potions. off me so when you battle is it random or I got white bunny ears so I should be able to go to here go to items equipment Oh, I guess I can't use it. I ain't reading that. I ain't talking to you. Either. Leave me alone. I'm trying to fight something before I quit. A cat. A cat. A turn-based cat. Oh, it's a... Oh, shit. It's a doggy. Okay. Bite. Oh shit. He just buffed him. Oh no. Um, scratch. Thought I was going to hit a little harder than that. Exposed. Oh shit. Oh no. We gotta go all out. Then pounce on him. Ah, uh, close. Ooh. This game is actually kind of cute. Well, not actually. It is cute. It's surprisingly... Pause. Surprisingly deep. Exposed. Okay. All right. All right. That was um Catlandia. Crisis at Fort Pawprint. Is it worth the five minutes? Absolutely. 
Absolutely. All right, uh, Brushboard Buddies, an unusual puzzle game about crafting with lovely atmosphere and some adorable creatures stabbing rabbits. Oh. Okay. Stabbing rabbits. Alrighty then. Set timer five minutes. All right, let's go. Campaign challenges, recipes, options. Uh, apple hunger. Woody is hungry. Help him get an apple by selecting the tree. You can select the item by clicking on it or the area below. When selected, the area gets a white border and the item starts to float. Okay. A wooden log blocks the forest. Select the log and destroy it with the destroy button so the forest can spawn a new tree and feed this motherfucker. Okay. Okay. Bye-bye. When Woody has an empty heart, he is sad and can't craft anymore. Luckily, destroying items with the destroy button makes him happy again. Destroy the log and make him happy and craft an apple. Oh, he's sad. Now he's happy. Don't. Don't dun don't don't dun Four spawn trees and rocky areas spawn rocks. Select an item impossible crafting outcomes are shown below the crafting button. Select an area, impossible destroying outcomes are shown below the destroying button. Remove the rock from the forest and get a wooden stick from the tree. Sometimes trees drop an apple and sometimes a wooden stick. What? So let's destroy the rock. Let's destroy that rock. What did this do? What just happened? Oh, Woody ran off with his buddy. The turnip lady joined. So you can use crafting recipes with up to two ingredients now. You don't control your companions directly. They move on their own. Every area requires a specific item to proceed. Click on the bouncing bubble to show how the knife is made. Click on the knife recipe's ingredients to show how its components are crafted. If you get stuck, use the restart button to top right. To craft the sharpened flint, you will have to select both the grindstone and the flint and then hit the crafting button. Okay, so I click that. Whoa, there's mad shit in this game. And I... A stick and a flint, I guess. Okay. So let me grab that. Let me craft a stick. Let me grab that. And let me craft that. And then let me craft that. Bro, what? Oh, okay. So I grabbed that. I don't destroy it because I don't need to. I don't destroy that either. I take the stick. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. As mentioned, possible outcomes of crafting and destroying are shown below the corresponding buttons. Craft a saw to proceed. Destroying multiple items at once is better because it will make the turn up lady lose only a quarter of her heart. Okay. So to get the saw, I need the knife with the sharpened flint. Knife and the sharpened flint.
Okay. Bro, what? Okay, so knife and a grindstone and flint. Grindstone and flint equal rock. So I took the thingy. Grab the stick. But I don't want that. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay. Bro, all right. Um, <laughs> um, it's worth the five minutes. I'll say that much. Worth the five minutes. A little bit confusing. But definitely worth the five minutes. I like the whole alchemy aspect of it. The whole Dr. Stone-esque. This plus this equals that. And then that equals that. And then that equals that. And then once we equal that, now we can equal that. I like... Ow. I like that whole whole breakdown. That whole aspect. Um, I just am confused on how to play the actual game, but yeah, no, definitely worth the five minutes. Shout out to Stephen Coiling, call Colling, excuse me. I really like the, uh, the art style too. Uh, Kitsugi, Kitsugi, the art of embracing damage and imperfections by purple little girl. This is a browser game. Love the browser game because I ain't got download nothing. All right. Run game. Let's embrace some imperfections, guys. Set timer for five minutes. The art of embracing damage. Let's start with this one. Oh no. To continue his power. Oh yeah, I've heard about Kintsugi. This is when they take, they being the Japanese, take broken or cracked or destroyed containers and they use gold to fill in the cracks, alluding to the idea that this vase, this container, this bowl is worth more after the imperfections. It's super dope. I love Japanese culture. In, in, in this aspect like there's some things about Japanese culture I'm like ah but there's a lot of shit where I'm just like yo that shit makes sense to stay three years on a rock oh shit fall down seven times get up eight yes i ain't here because i fell down i'm here because i got up To kill a bull by straightening its horns. Oh, ah, uh, oh, I didn't even see what the full object was. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. What was this? <laughs> Oh, 
Oh no. Alright, I might have to start this one over with. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? This is kind of like cheating, but it kind of isn't. But it kind of is. Because I don't want to have to start it over all over again. Oh, okay, it was like a bird. Okay. Alright, it was like a birdie. Alright. Son. Am I not going to be able to do this? Hey, let's go. You see? Because I embrace the imperfections. I'm trying my hardest. Timer went off, but I don't care. I'm doing stuff. I'm doing stuff bigger than what, which, what most people can agree on. Let this be a lesson. You don't give up, baby. Even when things seem difficult, things seem hard. You don't give up, baby. You keep pushing. Flower, bird, wind, moon. Kitsugi, the art of embracing damage and imperfections. I love it. 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 Okay. Purple little girl. Is it worth the five minutes? And once again, we've had this happen before. This is the example of a game or a project that could be worth five minutes that isn't five minutes long. Um definitely worth the five minutes it might take you five minutes especially if you don't go back and look at how that bird was put together but you might also be paying attention during the whole time and not streaming it so you know there's a little advantage there but yeah definitely worth the five minutes shout out to her um and uh this isn't last because i gotta download a new game because the fucking game in the beginning didn't work sorry excuse my language no not really escape chasm a small little RPG maker game about a lonely girl with a connection to another world that she sees in her dreams. By Timmy. By Timmy. <sighs> Whoa, what just happened? Don't know what just happened. Uh, hmm. In my head, I'm thinking about what game was game of the episode it might be escape chasm who knows oh windows cannot access specify path or file See? Just that shit. 
This that shit I be talking to y'all about. It's that bullshit. I don't know why these games be acting like they don't want to work with me. I see. I can't. Let me re-download it. Since I already introduced it, I can have two games that don't work on one episode. It's things we go through. The things we go through. All right, let's try this again. Whoop, whoop, boop. <sighs> All right, escaped chasm. No. No, it didn't. And I got a interesting Windows alert. Potentially unwanted software. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. Okay. I'm not telling you guys what to do. I'm not telling you guys not to play it or not. I'm just telling you that I'm not. So, jeez. And I thought I was ahead of the game today, too. I was downloading games. I downloaded the games, like, at 5 o'clock. Like, I was ready, ready. I guess I wasn't. I guess I wasn't. All right. So, we have Headliner by Unbound Creations. Award-winning adventure where you control the news and its impact on society. Ooh, this sounds like a... This sounds like one of those types of games, guys. Like one of those types of games where, you know, <laughs> we're, we're pushing the envelope, the proverbial envelope of what's going on in society. Yeah, it's my type of game. My type of game. And it works. So easily off the first rip. Let's go. <clears throat> Set timer for five minutes. This shit came in like Streets of Rage. Loading. Imprisoning dissonance. Hold, move farther away to run. You can also use keyboard or joystick. Strange illness spreads through Novistan. Conspiracy brews amongst people. What's happening here? You are the editor of a national news channel. But what's that? Okay. You are the headliner. Ooh. Ooh. Public opinion rests in your hands. That's some real shit, too. What's the latest scoop? Tell us, tell us, tell us. Hey, 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 tell, tell us, tell us. Did you hear the news? Oh, they are. Oh, no. They're chasing after me. Oh, no. What was that? Ah! You're probably asking yourself, how did I get here? That's because I'm the headliner, baby. Okay, my name is... Oh, I could be a guy. I'll be a black guy. Where's a black guy? He's got his, like, Jordan Peele. That would probably be, like, my stop. First name... Bryce... Oh, 
all bright. Sign up for instructor tutorial, pronoun. I like that. Office use only. Begin. I'm liking this game already, guys. On the first day. Afternoon, Bryce. I've heard good things about you. I hope you find work at Nova News adequately challenging. Here's today's list of articles for you to prove or reject. Got it. Refresh me on my job parties. Pars. Parties. Got it. Excellent. I have high hopes for you, Mr. Albright. Remember, we publish immediately on our network. Be the first to break the news. Each day you will get your daily salary disbursement in Noble Bucks. Something to change if you incur any penalties. The future of our channel depends on you. I'm about to have my third kid, and those embryo genetic mods ain't cheap, I tell you. Got it, boss. <laughs> Excellent. I trust you make the right calls. Click and hold left mouse on a paper to drag. Drag up to zoom. Release to put it down anywhere on the table. Think you're safe? Samantha B was changing into her PJs. Just like every night when she noticed something disturbing. A security camera from across was pointed directly into the window. Oh my god, she told us in tears. Have they been watching me all this time? Release on the paper to stamp it. Approve or reject all remaining stories. If you thought genetically modifying our food and our embryos was futuristic, you can. Uh, you may be surprised to find numerous over-the-counter pills have been evolved from genetically modified microorganisms. True biological synergy at its finest. Novastan can't not disregard global influence. For over a hundred years, the Union of Dunaby brought a steady stream of cheap goods and skilled workers. Thanks to Lyra's trade agreement, we were able to modify over 63% of the population. Indubitably, curious readers must have seen the ads on benches foreshadowing the mysterious Better Buzz. Is it a new sports drink or a juice cleanser? Perhaps just a soda. Either way, I'm excited. Man, if you don't get that shit out of here... Better Buzz. Alright. No, I'm not going that way. Oh, hey, Bryce. Clocking out already? She's cute. How was your day? I'm going to stay and finish writing an extra article for tomorrow. I've got to suck up to the bosses, you know. It's hard enough being a foreigner as it is. People are getting suspicious of our neighbor country, Lyris. I was working at a cafe yesterday when I overheard these two girls bickering, talking about some old, dirty Larisian. Then they noticed me look over and gave me the stink eye because I'm brown. Money, fame, and some sweet rims. Why does anyone move to a richer and bigger country with more opportunities, even if it means putting up with being an outsider? Isn't it ironic that in an age where we modify the genes of our unborn children, we still attach so much to nationality? Either way, it's not looking good for my work visa. You too, Bryce. Anyway, I could probably head back. Smoke breaks over. I'm sure we'll get to chat more in the next few days. Adios. Okay, girl. Listen, if you want to stay in the country, I got you. Give you that green card. <laughs> What's up for son? You heard about that better buzz thing? Better what? Oh yeah, I ain't gonna talk about it now that I pulled up. Hey bro, just getting off work, I take it. How's the headlining business thus far? Nice, Bryce. Noise! Curating the news must be a pretty evolved affair. The struggle is real. I've been working on being less anxious. So here I am, practicing my next comedy routine in front of complete strangers. Okay, um, 
this game was super dope. Was like super dope. Super dope. I like that game. Oh, was it worth the five minutes? Absolutely. Super important. Like I stated plenty of times when we talked about games looking into giving you a a brief glimpse into the world of those dealing with maybe identity crises, 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 dealing with identity issues, um, people who just live a life different than ours, how important it is to have those types of games. That game is super important, especially in a day like today where it's not always so easy to differentiate between news and propaganda, especially when we don't exactly trust either source. Super important. Shout out to that game. Hey, how's it going? Oh, whoa. Hey, how are you? And lastly, we have Planet Diver. Planet Diver is about an adventurous daredevil tackling her newest obsession, wingsuit diving by Fabraz. This is the last game. Let's get into it. Set timer for five minutes. All right. Let's do story. Uh... Oh, let me get you guys in here. Woohoo! Do you want to read a tutorial? Of course. Arrows to move around. Speed up and strike. Break and evade. Careful with dashing too much. Each dash slowly refills over time. Health problems. You only got two hits and then you die. Speed equals money. Let's go. Whoa, now. I warned you that it's a bad idea for your organics, says the robot with no sense of thrill. Let's show these bats who's boss. Try dashing down as an attack into a couple of them by pressing S or down. That sounds painful. For them, let's do this. Leroy! Oops, messed that up. Hey. Okay, this is I like this is nice. I like it. Got a nice little bop to it. Wow, so I gotta admit, I got freaked out by the speed there. Not surprising. Coming from the high-end AI with a monthly upgrade in your contract. Fair enough. You can press W or up to break and slow down. You're invincible during it too, which means you could break to evade through enemies or incoming hazards like those falling boulders. Rad. I didn't even see any boulders. Oh, here it comes. Is that the boulder? Oh, that's dope. Boom, boom, boom. 
Hey, 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 okay. Oh, the rocks also kill. Ah, I blew that one. The rocks also kill the bats. Nice. So you can kind of slipstream behind them. Oh, no. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> I'm so trash. I had a good run, too. What? Let's go. Whoa. Oh, they counted this too. Hey, okay. I love this bop. Bump, bump, bump. Hey, 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 Badass. Alright. Alright. And that was motherfucking Diver. That was super dope. That was a super dope game. Damn. Okay. Okay. Super fucking dope. Alright. Um, we got a drum roll? That's not a drum roll. Where my drum roll at? Don't have a drum roll. Oh, I gotta do this shit. Sorry. Sorry, I thought I loved you. All right, let me load up. All right, so for game of the episode, for episode, what was, what episode was this? Episode 19. Episode 19, game of the episode. Better not be an ad. Oh, shit. Here you go. We have... Motherfucking... Headliner. Navi News. Gunshots. Air horns. Shout out to Headliner for this game coming out of nowhere. And this game wasn't even a game I was planning on playing today. It just happened to be because one of the other games kind of fucked up. Well, let's just watch the trailer. I know how it is. Once again, this is by. Oh, we'll worry about it at the end. Welcome. Your job is simple decide which news to publish and inspire the next generation. Fraternize with your coworker. Endorse genetic modification. Babysit your brother. Put your country first and shop domestic. Meet colorful locals. Don't forget to feed feed the doggo. We tr tr trust you. 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 you, you. Son, this shit gets serious. We trust you will help our nation flourish. Ooh, 
Shout out to them, Unbound Creations. By, oh my God, that's voiced by my girl, Enaris Quinones. Oh, snap. Shout out to her. Damn, it's, such, it's crazy how things all come together like butt cheeks. Shout out to this game. I said it already, but I'll say it again. Super dope concept and super important concept. Look at the look at the awards. Look at the awards. Silver War for Games for Good Series Play 2019. Winner Best Game Intel Buzz Seattle 2018. Finalist for Best Action Adventure Game at Tiga. Official Selection Indie Mega Booth PAX West Showcase 2018. Official Selection Wordplay Toronto 2018. Official Selection Seattle Indies Expo 2018. Damn, bro. But look at this. Read twice. Fake news. Sad. This is fire. Definitely worth the $13.99. The $13.99. Y'all. Yeah. Yeah. This is legit. This is a legit game. I definitely can't wait to get back into this. This is going to be one of those games that I play. Like, yeah, yeah, I'm adding this to my collection. Um, shout out to this game. Shout out to this game. But yeah, y'all know what it is. It's your boy B Green. Episode 19, five minutes with the indie in the books. Bam, 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 bam. And yeah, it was a good one. It was a good one. A lot of dope games. A lot of dope games. The... Tennis joint, the Cardinal change joint at the beginning, that ring ring game, which is super motherfucking creepy. I ain't like that shit. Uh, Dungeons and Lesbians, the Old Man game, Catlandia. Yeah, like every game today was super dope. Minus the two fucking games we couldn't play. Like, <sighs> they slipping. They slipping. But. Y'all know what it is. It's your boy B Green. Episode 19 in the books. Episode 20 will go down Friday. Set your alarm. Set your clocks. Set your TV. Set your watch. And yeah, y'all know what it is. Same funky place. Same funky channel. Yeah. Stay safe. Stay lovely. Stay good. Stay green. Y'all know what it is. It's your boy. Gunshots, air horns, Omaiwa, Moshinderu. And y'all know what it is. Roll that motherfucking outro.